purpose of this lab project was to manufacture and test a CNC milling fixture which would hold the IME 144 mill project number two family of parts during their CNC milling operations, utilizing Mighty Byte fixture clamps, SolidWorks, HSM Works, and the Haas CNC mill. During this project, my goal was to create a fixture that looked clean and wasn't overcomplicated. I had to start out designing the fixture and calculating the correct measurements of key features that would ensure parts would be held correctly and not get thrown. I then created a CAD model of this and then programmed a CNC code so I could machine my fixture. The constraints that we were given are the following. We needed to have a fixture base size that matched the same exact one that Trion would give us. We had to mount to this Haas CNC mill table. It had to be able to be indicated parallel to the CNC machine's axes. The fixture must be capable of producing one finished part per loading cycle. We must allow a CNC program to qualify datums during CNC operation and locate the part off of datums. It had to be able to be load and unload in under a minute. And the clamping forces had to be able to withstand the tooling forces with a minimum safety factor of two. I include two Mighty Bike clamps on each operation to ensure even clamping on a part and so that my parts would stay in my fixture while being machined. The flatness of the plate was the primary datum. I used a rail for each operation as a secondary datum and I used pins as tertiary datums. DFM was a huge factor in my fixture design so I made it very simple so that it would be simple to make and very hard to screw up. To test my design, I first checked if the fixture would hold the stock correctly. After figuring that out, I ran my part to see if my fixture would hold up and not throw the part or break the CNC machine. My project worked out great. The key results were observations of running my part successfully and not breaking tools or the CNC machine. Nice! Happy Trion! The limitation of my design is only being able to run one part at a time. However, I think this is one of the reasons I was so successful because I just kept the design simple. I think that my results are exactly what I expected because I was expecting a successful run. My most important results were running my parts correctly and keeping my design simple. The only issue I had was one of the Mighty Bike clamps on OP2 didn't have an easy fit for holding the part. This would be the only redesign I could think of, but other than that I'm very satisfied with, with my end project. I learned a lot in this project about what goes into designing a fixture and learned more about cam programming and using the CNC machine.